Let's solve the system of uh, linear equation with three unknowns using Kramer's method. So uh, Kramer's method tells me x you can find by the determinant of x divided by the determinant of uh, the variables of x, y, and z. y you find by dy by determinant of y by determ by divided by d and z is dz over d. Okay, so let me first write d. d is the determinant of the coefficients of the variables. So you just the coefficient of x is 1, so you write 1, 1, 1, 2, negative 3, 4, and 5, negative 2 and 1, negative 1. Okay, so dx would be, I'm going, not, I'm not going to write the coefficients of x, you don't, you ignore or you don't write the coefficients of x, so let me write the coefficients of y, so this is 1, negative 3, negative 2, and 1, 4, negative 1. Now, in place of the coefficient of x, you write the constants, which is 6, 13, 5. And dy, so let me scroll down. So dy is the same thing. You write the coefficient of x, which are 1, 2, and 5. 1, 2, 5. You don't write the coefficient of y, but you write the coefficient of z, uh, z which is 1, 4, negative 1. And you write the constant here in place of y, that is 6, 13, 5. So this is the determinant of y, dy, and finally dz. So dz, you write the coefficient of x, so that is 1, 2, 5. You write the coefficient of y, which is 1, negative 3, negative 2, 1, negative 3, negative 2, and you don't write the coefficient of z, but you write the constant, which is 6, 13, 5. So I'm going to do faster here, because in my previous two videos I've shown how to write, find the determinants here. So this would be, so you start with 1, you're crossing out this row and this column. So this is 1 times this is negative 3 times negative 1, which is 3. Take away negative 8, so that is 3 plus 8. I'm doing it directly. Then you have to put a minus 1 here. Just you cross out this row and this column, and then you find the determinant of the 2 by 2 matrix that you see. So that is this, uh, this entry which is 1, you have to put a minus 1 there, and then you multiply 2 times negative 1, which is negative 2, times, uh, sorry, take away 20. Okay, and plus 1 times, you, you're crossing this out and this row out. So that you have to multiply this 2 and take away this product. So this is negative 4, and this is take away negative 15, so which is going to be plus 15. I hope you understand this. So this is 1 times 11 minus 1 times minus 22 plus 1 times 11. So this is 11 plus 22 plus 11. So this is 44. So the D, the determinant of the coefficient of x, y, and z is 44. So let me do this faster, even faster. So this is 6 times. So you are crossing this out, this row. You're crossing this row and this out. Okay, so this is here to multiply this times this. So this is the same thing. So this is going to be 3 plus 3 plus 8, which is 11. 
minus 1 times this will change. So you're crossing this row and this column. So you have to multiply this too. So this is minus 13, minus 20. And then you're crossing this out. So this is plus 1 times. So this is minus 26. Take away minus 15, which is plus 50. So this is 66. This is how much? Minus 33. So this is plus 33. So this is plus 99. Take away 11, which is plus 88. Okay, and finally, not finally, so this would be, I would like you to do this yourself. I have worked this out. So this would be D, this is, 40, this is going to be 44, the same process. And this is going to be 132. You can work this out yourself. Okay, so now, so let's use the formula. So your x is going to be dx divided by d. What is dx? dx is 88 divided by d, which is 44. So x is 2. The y is dy divided by d. So dy is 44 divided by 44, which is equal to 1. And your z is, your dz was 132, okay, which is 132 divided by 44, which is 3. So x, y, and z are three neat numbers. x is 2, y is 1, z is 3. Now, I've shown this in, in my last video. You can also use a graphic calculator to find the determinant. So let's do this on a calculator. So, <clears throat> so let me exit, exit, and go to matrix. And let's me let us make this matrix. Uh, so this matrix is one, six, one. 2, 13, 4, and 5, 5, negative 1. Okay, and then exit, exit, but option, matrix, determinant of matrix alpha A is 46. I've done some mistake, so let's check it. Uh, go to run, exit, matrix. Okay, so let's check. 1, 6, 1, 2, 13, 4, 5, 5. Yeah, so this is the mistake. So 5, 5, negative 1, then exit. So go to option, matrix, determinant of matrix, alpha A, which is 44. Okay, same way you can find the determinant of this. And hopefully this video is helpful. So this is how you can solve a system of uh, three unknowns using Kramer's method.